this is Nala. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Let's go. and hit the little bell to receive the latest updates. So excited to have you here. Today we're doing a booty workout in the gym. And that's right, we're doing another booty workout. It's gonna be a tricep workout. I'm super excited to do it with you guys. Um, basically, tricep workout means that you're doing three exercises in a row for three sets, uh, triceps. So you're gonna do nine exercises in total, um, three sets of each. So you're doing a lot of each, and you're getting a lot done in a short period of time. So this workout only took me about 45 minutes to do, but it's a good one. It'll get you sweating, and it'll get you your booty growing, because you're working all different um, angles of your glutes. That's also another trick when you're training your glutes. You want to train every single angle. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to do today. We're going to get a great workout in, and uh, let's go do it. Apparently I'm super naking it out today. Just do it. Woohoo! Let's get her done guys. Workout for today. Hey guys, so welcome back to the workout. Today we're doing a gym glute and leg workout. We're starting off with barbell back squats today. Uh, the idea here is that we want to do at least one to two sets with just the barbell to kind of get used to the weight, um, getting used to the core contraction, the glute contraction, keeping the weight in the heels, and then putting on the heavier weights when you're ready. Remember that we are doing triceps, so you don't want to put your maximal weight on. Uh, you want to make sure that you have enough energy for all three exercises that, we'll be, that we will be doing. Triceps means exactly that. You're doing three exercises in a row with little to no rest in between. Uh, so for this first exercise, we're doing barbell back squats. Uh, you want to keep your weight in your heels, contracting your glutes and your core at the top of the exercise, and then really going nice and slow on the way up and on the way down, really challenging yourself, and you are doing 10 reps. Okay, so for this next exercise, we're doing band glute kickbacks. So this is often done with cables, but with this one here, you can just use a band. And you put it around both of your angles. Make sure you are bent over at the hips to make sure to ensure, sorry, that you have a better angle on your upper top glute area. You really want to make sure that you're squeezing that area, holding it for a second, and then coming down nice and slow to keep that contraction. Last of our tricep exercise is a dumbbell deadlift. You can either do pulses or go down a little lower to really feel the stretch in the hamstrings. Your choice here, uh, just make sure you're squeezing your core and the glutes, of course, the entire time. What's next? So next we're doing some barbell deadlifts. Really make sure that you have a really straight back from your shoulders all the way to your hips and then you have your shoulders retracted in the entire exercise. Keeping the core engaged and going nice and slow, feeling the stretch in the hamstrings. You can either do regular deadlifts or straight leg deadlifts like the ones I'm doing here. Again, the option is yours. We're doing 10 reps. Make sure you're not doing too heavy of weight because we are doing another tricep. So for lateral glute kicks, we're gonna keep the band around our knees, and then we're gonna kick our, we're gonna kick outwardly and really out just to the side, working the lateral part of our glutes, so the side portion of our glutes. This is kind of the exercise you do if you wanna get, you know, hippie. You wanna to try to build the outside portion of your bum. So that's what we're doing in this exercise here. That's what you kinda of wanna picture. <laughs> that helps, let me know, comment below if you have any more questions. 
The third and last exercise in this tri set is a goblet squat. You can either do it with the band around your knees or you can remove it. Um, I'm doing kind of not too heavy of a weight because I was quite tired at this point. I'm not gonna lie, guys. It was a hard workout doing tri sets, and we're not done. We still have one more to go. So uh, make sure you're just keeping your weight in the glute, sorry, weight in the heels, glutes, and core engaged the entire time. And then, of course, having a smile because it's fun. Okay guys, so last try set for this one. You need a block or a, a bench like I'm using here. And you're doing a glute bridge with another kind of forward kick. So you're actually extending through your hips and then bring your knees past you all the way to your shoulders. So you're trying to push up to glute bridge and then pass a little further, squeezing that co your core and glutes in every rep. Um, you really start feeling this as you kind of get up into the higher reps. The first few seem kind of easy and make sure that that band doesn't roll like it is for me. You wanna just take a sec, make sure it's nice and straight because it kind of helps with the contraction a little better. Push up through onto the shoulders, bringing the knee past your shoulders, kind of the knee to the wall behind you, really squeezing your core. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, this next exercise looks really funny. Here's another angle. They're called frogger pumps. So you're in a butterfly position, like in yoga, and then you're pumping your hips up to the sky, squeezing your heels together. Um, Strangely enough, this actually really tires you out. You are doing 30 to 40 pumps. Um, as you can see, I'm exhausted, but it really squeezes your glutes really, really well. It gets your overall different angle of the of the glutes, which I really enjoy. And then this last exercise, you're just doing some butterfly crunch, crunches. It's just a different kind of crunch. Um, challenge yourself, try something new, why not? I hope you guys enjoyed the workout. Bye. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and got some great tips from the workout. I love training my glutes and legs in general. So if you guys want me to do another workout video, please comment below which one you'd like to do, like to see me do. I was thinking about back, but uh, let me know what you guys want and I'll make sure to make that happen. Also stay tuned for a yoga workout that I'll be doing next week, um, possibly over the weekend. So stay tuned for that one. It will be a yoga, booty, training, leg training, exercise, kind of work out. It's going to be a little interesting, a little something different I've kind of improvised off of. We'll see how it goes. So let's go try that out. Stay tuned. I hope you guys all have an amazing week. Please remember to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Bye guys. Have an amazing